Craig and Cindy Broadhead moved their family here from California where they owned a pest control business. They had always dreamed of owning their own home, but the housing prices in California were just too expensive for them to get a home large enough for their family in a safe area with good schools. The opportunity came about for them to sell their business and move to Arkansas where they were able to pay cash for their new home. This is how it all went down. Hi, I'm Eric Eby and welcome to another episode of Naturally NWA. You know, one of the things I love the most about being a realtor here is I get to help people relocate from all over the country. Moving to a new area can be scary on its own, but when you're talking about moving across the country like the Broadheads did, that presents a whole set of unique challenges. Thankfully for them, I have a process and a system that makes it very easy. When Craig first contacted me about moving here, some of the most important things to them were that they had some privacy from their neighbors and that they would be on the lake. Now, so I started out by sending them some properties that match that criteria. And unfortunately, the market was extremely hot. Uh, this was in the spring of 2021. And before they could hop on a plane and get here, some of their favorite properties had gone pending. So what we did was we kept looking at uh, different options and they hopped on a plane um, and they came down here and we looked at a few. Uh, unfortunately, none of those that we looked at on that trip uh, matched their criteria, but they were able to kind of get a sense of the area and get a target area dialed in so that we could really go after our home search. Now, thankfully, they already had some family living here in Northwest Arkansas. They were able to come to some open houses and do some FaceTime showings with them. And then we were able to get them under contract on their house here in Rogers that I'm standing in front of right now. It's a beautiful, beautiful property. Now, the one thing that's missing from their initial list is the lake. We are not on the lake here, but that's a very common thing for buyers to say that they want something um, or that's something very important and they end up buying something else. Um, this house and this property does check off every one of their other boxes, which is why they were able to uh, justify not being on the lake. The good news for them is we're only about 10, 15 minutes from the lake. And so they've even got a shop building that they can keep their boat in. Let's go in here and see if they're home and let's go talk to them about their experience buying a home on the other side of the country and see what they like best about Northwest Arkansas. Come on. So I'm sitting here with Craig and Cindy Broadhead. How are you guys doing? Great. Doing great. Awesome. Yeah. Tell me, tell me what you guys think about your new home. Oh, we, we love it here. This is a beautiful home. We, we're on seven acres, about four acres of grass, three acres of trees. Yep. You know, so we're we're definitely excited to be here. That's a beautiful property. I was I'm I'm I was just talking to these guys. I, I'm actually jealous of the property that you guys ended up with. This be exactly what I would want. Cindy, what do you what do you think about the new place? Magical. The tree lined streets coming up. Yes. I, I always describe it as magical, gorgeous. Green. It's Waking green. Waking up to green. deer in the yard. Yeah. All the things. It's it's. Yeah, and you guys haven't even been here for fall yet, no. so we're about to, all these trees out here are going to be the most beautiful colors you've ever seen here in about two weeks probably, so that'll be, yeah. that'll be something else is California, Californians, yes. Calif I think that's how you Cal say it. Californian, yeah. Okay, um, you, don't, you don't have four seasons there, no. so here in Northwest Arkansas we've got four seasons, so you're going to get to experience the trees changing colors, and I'm excited for that for you guys because it's a beautiful time of year here. Switching gears a little bit, let's talk about buying a house across on the other side of the country basically. Was that process stressful for you guys or was it easier than you thought it would be? Basically know, knowing you from YouTube, we, we, we saw you from YouTube in mm -hmm. California. Mm -hmm. So we already saw the process yep. from, from your explanations and all the videos. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think it was relatively easy mm -hmm. to 
like do all the, look at all the listings and go through the whole the whole process with you mm -hmm. through email and through phone. Yep. Yeah. Perfect. So easier than you thought. Yeah. yeah about it, you? it wasn't bad at all. I mean, even when you're local, you're still going to be looking at the you know listings on your right. phone exactly. or your computer. Uh -huh. So it wasn't that much different. I mean, it was a little weird putting an offer on a house and we hadn't literally seen you it. You hadn't been person. inside of it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. right. That's but the luckily, biggest trip for a lot of people is like, man, I'm buying something I've never even been inside yet. Yeah, mm -hmm. but we were able to, Craig was able to come out for the home inspection, which right. was, you know, yeah. it was, it was if good we to... had to, we could have backed out at that right. point, mm -hmm. but it was a wonderful home. It's perfect for us. It fits us. The land is beyond amazing. Yes. So. Mm -hmm. Um, I mean, we were lucky we were able to come out at that point in the process. Right. You guys came out for a couple of days and we looked at a couple of houses on the lake and you kind of already had in your mind you wanted to be in the Rogers area and I think that's because you had watched all my videos and you said, it sounds like Rogers is the place to be, right? Yeah. yeah. And, gotcha. And the, your videos helped us kind of get a sense of I, like you have the um, pros and cons of the different cities. Right. So it gave us a sense of, okay. Bella, what's good about Bella Vista, what's mm -hmm. good about Rogers, mm -hmm. what's good about Fayetteville, and, and what are the cons of those places. And then also coming out here to visit gave us the opportunity to see, wow, Bella Vista is gorgeous, but I don't know if I want to do the windy roads right. every single day. Right. And, you know, all the different things, like what did we want to be close to and what yeah. we wanted. We wanted land right. and things like that. So that kind of is probably a good segue into my last question for you guys. Is there anything that surprised you about the area or what, what is the thing you, you found you, you love the most about Northwest Arkansas? Can I take this first? Yeah. Okay, so when we came here, uh, uh, I didn't know what to expect, sure. right? Mm -hmm. You didn't think I'd be wearing shoes probably. <laughs> I mean, who ever even <laughs> talks about Arkansas? Like, right. I, I never would have thought of Arkansas ever. Mm -hmm. And so when we drove in and drove into the main, you know, Bentonville Rogers, mm -hmm. where like Top Golf is mm -hmm. and the Amp and all that shopping, the mall, I was like, whoa, this is like a normal place. And that's <laughs> a problem, but I was like expecting more farm and hick yeah, kind of yeah. country uh -huh. living. And this is just a normal city mm -hmm. and it has all the shopping that I want. Mm -hmm. It has tons of entertainment, mm -hmm. all the restaurants that I love. Mm -hmm. I mean, some restaurants that like I would have to travel to go to, we have here. Right. Which is so cool. Right, yeah. Uh -huh. Sorry. <laughs> no, that was, that was a great answer. What yeah. Did, did, you, did, did you have anything to add to that, Craig? Yeah, I mean, we basically, in order to leave California, we still wanted the perks of having hills and water mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. and lakes, which we, we've been looking all around, like the Tennessees, mm -hmm. not Tennessees, <laughs> the Carolinas, the Carolinas yeah. Tennessee, Virginia, and this this really fit our, the, our, all of our boxes mm -hmm. because you this area has all of that and more. Right. Plus, there's almost all the shopping you need out here. There's mm -hmm. a half a million people in the NWA area, mm -hmm. which to me kind of feels like a mini Orange County, California. Yeah. You know, it's very organized. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of money in this area too to, yep. keep, to keep it nice and clean. Right. So that's what really kind of fit all of our boxes and mm -hmm. got us excited about this area. Well, thank you guys again for uh, for doing this and uh, it was great visiting with you today. Yeah, thank yeah. you. Thanks. Thank you, Eric. Perfect. So if you're like Craig and Cindy and want to move across the country but don't think it's going to be possible to pull off, just remember that I have a plan that makes it easy and stress-free. And if you have any additional questions about the process or the local real estate market here in Northwest Arkansas, please feel free to call me at the number below, send me a message, or send me an email at eric at and I'll be happy to answer any questions that you have. And don't forget to click the subscribe button above so you can stay in tune with everything that's going on here in Northwest Arkansas and be notified when new videos come out. I'm Eric Eby with HomeQuest Realty, and I can't wait to show you more of our beautiful area on the next episode of Naturally NWA.